This video is brought to you by Regular Motor Oil. Now, if you know, I know you've heard a lot about synthetics and additives, but just regular motor oil is what you want. So here's an update on the LS. We're just running the wiring harness now just to get everything nice and shortened up and uh, and fixed into the proper place so it'll be all hidden. Um, you can see right here I've already started a little bit of it. Nice and hidden and the rest will be all loomed up closed and nice and hidden. And then there's a plastic cover from the Mercedes body originally that will cover all of this wiring and it'll run all into here into the computer. Um, we'd like to fire it up but our exhaust guys kind of made a mistake and they uh, Put in our wastegate pipe too close to the uh, too close to the frame. So it's Friday, and not so sure if we're gonna be able to get it fired up tonight. But if we pull a late one, maybe we'll be able to. What do you think, Rich? I think so. I think I'm going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I think everything looks pretty decent. I'm pretty happy for the most part. Um, uh, yeah, once we get the fuse box mounted, and uh, we'll probably. Are you going to cover all this up yet? Sure, yeah. I, I'm about ready to cover this up. Yeah, just might, about. might as well. Put the clamp on. He, uh, no, don't worry about that clamp. Okay. I got to run, grab a couple fittings, and you can put the starter on underneath. I got to get one hose yet for the um, water. We can throw water in it, oil in it. At least crank it over. Yeah. We can crank it over, and then we can use the footage of it on the dyno, and you can dub that over, Aaron, and we got it running. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, just cranking it over and it moving. You can slow that down, some movie magic, and then it'll look like it's running, and then the sound. Yeah. And then, um, yeah. Movie magic's yeah. where it's at. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> Yay, it's amazing. So I tried finding one of these thermostat housings online, but they were all on back order. I couldn't believe it. So we got my buddy there, uh, Ian, from International Stretcher to weld a few thermostat housings together, and uh, this is what we kind of ended up with. Uh, Ian makes stretchers that uh, go off-road, so if you end up in uh, the side of a mountain or whatever and the paramedics come and grab you, it'd be his stretcher that you uh, they actually carry you out in. So if you're laying in a ditch and the paramedics show up and, and it's not made by International Stretcher, tell them to go back and get the right one because uh, nothing but the best comes out of Dunville. So here we go. Hey, hey, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you love the channel, consider heading over to Patreon. There's a lot of stuff happening there to help support the channel. And remember, if you're not filthy, you're not rich.